prove that if H is normal in G and K is normal in G, then their intersection is also a normal subgroup of G. So proof. Now, two things need to be shown. One, that H intersect K is a subgroup, and two, that it's actually a normal subgroup. Um, so let me just say H intersection K is a subgroup of G. So that part uh, we'll assume is taken care of. It's pretty easy to, to do. So we'll start the proof by supposing that H is normal in G and K is normal in G. And we'll show that H intersection K is normal in G. So take any, say X in the intersection and little g in capital G. And what do we need to show? Let me, let me write it over here. We need to show that x, sorry, that g, x, g inverse is in the intersection. Okay, that's what we need to show. Now, since x is in the intersection, we have that x is in H and x is in K. Let's go ahead and write down g, x, g inverse and see what happens. So then g, x, g inverse, well, g is in G and x is in H. So this is an H because H is normal in G and x is in an h, and g is in g. Likewise, g, x, g inverse is in k. And this is because k is normal in g, x is in k, we have that here, and little g is in capital G. So we have that g, x, g inverse is in an h, and g, x, g inverse is in k. So thus, g, x, g inverse lives inside the intersection, h intersection, k. And that's it. We're done. So therefore, h intersect k is a normal subgroup of g. Pretty easy proof. I hope this helps.